new Hellboy movie will be released this year. You probably haven't heard of it. The trailer came out yesterday. Will it feature the legendary Ron Perlman, 74 years old? No, no it will not. So, nobody cares. Nobody's interested. And that's the picture that has people already worried. It looks like a fan-made well, movie. Looks like a fan-made movie. I didn't even watch the full trailer yet. But uh, yeah, it looks like they shot it cheaply in a forest. I was the cast. I have no clue who anyone of those people is. Uh, he might be familiar. Is it a voice actor? Deadpool. Uh, was he the bad guy in Deadpool? Is that him? Deadpool 2. No. Deadly Home Horror Movies. Shiro's. <laughs> Uh, he looks familiar, I don't know, but he's the Hellboy, he's the new Hellboy. And yeah, it's released by IGN, the trailer, which has not too many views yet. I'm gonna go through the comments in a second, like half a million. And then Catch Up Entertainment, I don't even know what that is, but they are even less get that out of my screen. Like half of that even. And so it's, it's, you know, <sighs> undercover, rock to the table. My people don't have high hopes already. Who can blame them? We all want more Ron Perlman. Uh, I don't think that's going to happen anymore. He's too old already. But definitely the Hellboy we all grew up with. The best goddamn Hellboy. I even watched the other movie, the Hellboy movie without Ron Perlman. I can't even remember what it was called. Oh boy. Call of Darkness? This one, right? Ah, Ian McShane was in there. Right, Miller Jovovich. I remember a little bit. They had a lot of well known actors. At least. Ah, I didn't like it too much. That's why they're in the sequel for this one. But yeah. No. No one quite liked it that much. So people are already worried that this is gonna be butchered. I'm gonna... Well, I wanna even watch the trailer. My hopes are super low. I'm just gonna look at pictures. <laughs> so you can see how... Damn. That is a fan-made thing. Can't tell me otherwise. Just by the pictures alone. Looks like they just shot it in a cheap forest. And the costume looks cheap. And I don't even see any other creatures. That's Hellboy himself. Yeah, this looks super cheap. Right, look at that. Ah, I don't even think I'm gonna watch it. If it randomly appears in August, I believe. I ah, saw so August somewhere. Oh boy. Call of Darkness? No, not you. Crow, the cooked, the, the cooked man. The cooked man. Really stayed. 2024, it doesn't have a release date. Straight to Netflix you go. No, just kidding. I'm gonna give it a fair chance. We're not even watching it. Instead of Hellboy 3, they made two more different movies with different actors. Makes zero sense. Golden Army was freaking amazing. Everybody liked Ron Perlman. And he deserved a third movie. They even teased it in the Golden Army. With his children. Passing on the torch or so. Some I remember this clip. Just this little clip has more views than this trailer bro will ever get. Do they have? Yeah, anyways. Yeah, anyways. <laughs> if anyone else has $20, we can make a movie too. Going from Guillermo del Toro to this crazy. This is crazy. This looks like a fan film. Which studio is behind this? Did I even look? It doesn't tell much. It doesn't say much. Oh boy, seems to be somewhat lacking in the personality department this time around. Real hell is seeming is seeing a franchise you love be reduced 
to Toby original, so Toby, I don't know what that is. Imagine if the movie budget was 15 to, instead of 20. Yeah, they might have gotten a good costume at least. Oof, the roasts are here. I didn't even need to read through it beforehand to know that this is gonna get roasted. Uh, this, uh, the budget is obviously lacking, but I'll give credit where credit is due. This looks like the most comic accurate Hellboy to date. The comics literally classify as dark fantasy horror before action adventure. It looks like the filmmaker decided to make a proper horror themed investigation story from the books, which is kind of what most of the stories are in Hellboy comics. Budget or not, they definitely checked all the right boxes in terms of adaptation. And all this movie needs to be is interesting. Actually, that wasn't sarcastic at all. I thought it's gonna be sarcastic at all. At how? Sarcastic at Hellboy. At this point, Hellboy would do much better as an animated series. Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> it looks like an Instagram cosplayer. I'm sure there are better Instagram cosplayers than that. Don't discredit them. Oh boy. Instagram cosplay. <laughs> yeah, look. Look, way better. I'm just clicking on that. Why am I doing that? There are probably pictures here. That's not a cosplay, right? Is that a cosplay? Oh, come on. That's not what I clicked at all. Where are the male cosplays? This one. Pinterest. No. No, maybe. No, he does look better. Okay. Ah, he does look better. Why are they all female? <laughs> that looks like Lego Hellboy. It's kind of cool. Come on, give me the picture. That's too small. It's too small. Damn you. Okay. Back to the comments. It's like if Hellboy entered into the public domain and everybody made their own crappy version of Hellboy. When in fact they got it right the first time around. It's not public domain. He's not. You can't make a Hellboy movie if the girl playing Hellboy looks like your junior high PE teacher dressed up as Hellboy for Halloween. Oof. Nothing beats the original Hellboy. That movie was so good. I watched it so many times. Ain't no way they got my boy, Hellboy, the boy, looking like the thing from Fantastic Four. Ketchup Entertainment. Is that the studio? More like flopped entertainment because ain't no way this movie gonna make money at all. Oh, you can't take a name like that serious. Is that the goddamn studio? <laughs> Mustard Films presented the, the, the presentation. This movie was written by Mike Mingola, creator of Hellboy, by the way. Really? So was the last one. Mignola hated what the Doro did to Hellboy and after the Golden Army bombed. He decided not to allow them to make another movie. Okay, it's not working out for him. Okay, that's interesting to know. What in the sci-fi channel is going on here? Should have just made it animated if you weren't bringing back Ronald well, Mark, oh, totally butchered the name. Love it. A Hobo animated anthology series where each episode is about a different monster in a different animation style would be awesome. Shame we're just getting low and low budget reboots instead. And it's probably will be the last one. Ah, I should never say that. They love remaking everything. Oh boy, the cooked movie. Last minute film assignment for film school. Oof. Oof. I'm willing to give it a chance. A low budget, more focused on the cryptide mystery solving. Let's see what you get. I don't think that's gonna be interesting for me. So... It has the comic vibes. Uh, maybe we just all expect that the Hellboy franchise, the original one, on movie screens to continue. Okay. Okay. So it actually has the original creator. Which is. Now we have a Hellboy at home. That was, of course, gonna happen to Chuck. This is a fan made film. And I'm pretty sure we are through with the 
the homeboy jokes as I'm trying to darken my voice to sound more like Ron Perlman himself. If it's not Ron Perlman, it's not my Hellboy. And we have Ron Perlman Hellboy voice line somewhere. Perlman Hellboy voice lines. Did I even watch that in English? I believe I just watched it in German. I see Darth Vader in here, that probably is not going to be what I want. I'm probably going to get copyrighted too, come on, give me something. Top voices of Ron Perlman. I'm going to find something here. Oh, <laughs> are we? Satan, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? It's gotta be one. Yeah. Don't be too loud, please. What did you see? Ghosts. Looking for help, I think. But they didn't want me. What? <laughs> what? Uh, okay, that's not what I wanted at all. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna regret it. Please don't blow my ears up. That's an ad, isn't it? There it is. Gleich geht's weiter. Love you too. Oh, hell boy. German. That's the one. Love you too, ads. God, I can't even ignore it. please I watched it in German so this is gonna be super confusing right. and we have some Ron Perlman voices please in German oh. It's so German. So German. Höllisch groß war das. Das reicht. Um, it's a hell big. Hell big. Yeah. No, that it's big like hell. That doesn't even translate right into German. Thanks for the ads. I would like to wish Ron Perlman a very... <laughs> uh. Just what was it that... What you looking at, John? Look at them ugly suckers, Blue. One sheet of glass between them and us. <sighs> outside, I could be outside. Don't get psychic with me, fella. I'm never gonna get a girl I drive around in a garbage truck. We don't take hints. Just what was it that landed you this job pushing pancakes, huh? What was it? Punctuality. Mm, okay. I'm cool with that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Got it. Got it. We're done. We're done. Got it. Got it. Got it. Good. 